We're surrounded by great computing technologies that have enormous impacts on our lives and enable us to do things that were simply unimaginable just a few years ago. But they are changing us. They are changing how we live, what information we see, and how we interact with one another. What's the impact of these technologies on society? Are they having the effects we want? Are there unintended consequences? These are the kinds of questions that drive our program in societal computing as we tackle the most critical societal problems we currently face. Problems like, how do we ensure our private data stays private and our systems are secure against an increasing range of attacks and attackers? How do we facilitate the large-scale collaboration that's essential to sustain our digital infrastructure? What new technologies will spur equitable global development? How do we build systems that enhance environmental sustainability? Where can we apply network science to understand complex socio-technical systems? The students in our Societal Computing PhD program are taking on these challenges. They're doing critical research that is changing the world. They are asking the right questions and applying machine learning, statistics, and network analysis techniques to find the answers. They're designing algorithms and systems and deploying them in the world to expand our notion of what's possible. Their preparation at Carnegie Mellon has enabled our students to take leadership roles, taking academic positions at leading universities like Harvard, Berkeley, Vanderbilt, UC San Diego, West Point, Keist in South Korea, and Peking University in China. They're doing groundbreaking research at companies like Google, Facebook, IBM, and Microsoft, and joining or starting their own ventures to deploy new technologies in the world. The student who will flourish in our societal computing program is someone who has a deep technical background and interest, but realize they're missing something. They're not satisfied with just additional computer science education. They almost always have some other burning interest, whether it's in policy, environmental science, linguistics, or behavioral science. We want students who are interested in going out there and solving societal problems using their technical skills. Those are the students we're looking for.